Hello, and welcome to the This Happened Today in History podcast for February 12th. I am your host, Mr. Miller. This podcast will cover a number of topics that happened on this date in history. Please visit the podcast webpage at thishappentoday.buzzsprout.com to download the worksheet that will help you organize your information as well as develop your own ideas on how these events change the world around us. If you are interested in hearing more, please consider subscribing so you will not miss out on what happened tomorrow in history. Our first event happened in 1935. The 785-foot USS Macon, a rigid-framed airship, crashed off the coast of California. It was built and operated by the United States Navy for scouting and was the last U.S. Navy dirigible built. Her sister ship, the USS Akron, had crashed off the New Jersey coast on April 4, 1933, killing 73 passengers and crew. The USS Macon and her sister ship, USS Akron, were among the biggest flying objects in the world. Although the Hindenburg was bigger, the two airships still hold the record for the biggest helium-filled airships. Due to the crashes, the U.S. Navy suspended all plans for further helium-filled airships. In 1924, Calvin Coolidge became the first U.S. president to deliver an address to the American people by radio. The message was short, and the main focus was Coolidge's announcement that he was going to run for president. His broadcast opened the door for future presidents to use the radio for mass communication. FDR was by far the most popular with his fireside chats with the American people. Calvin Coolidge was the president that started this movement and popularized this form of communication. Finally, in 2014, a sinkhole opened up under a classic Corvette museum in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Eight of the rare sports cars fell into the sinkhole. The hole was estimated at being 30 feet deep and about 40 feet across. Sinkholes are caused when water underground erodes a layer and creates a cavernous area. When there is enough erosion and the ground cannot support the weight above, the topsoil and anything on it collapses into the eroded area. This could be caused by a broken pipe, underground river, etc. Another type of sinkhole happens when the water erodes a layer of softer rock such as limestone, salt, or gypsum. Due to underlying deposits of limestone, Florida has many sinkholes. Many are in the form of lakes that have formed after old sinkholes have refilled with water. You have been listening to the This Happened Today in History podcast for February 12th. I thank you for listening and I hope that you have enjoyed learning about historical events from the past. Thank you to the following websites for the information regarding today's topics. ThePeopleHistory.com RealClearHistory.com in the Florida Department of Environmental Protection. The music used as the background track for this podcast is Americana, created by Kevin McLeod on Incompetech.com. If you enjoyed this information and would like to hear more, please consider subscribing, as this will keep the historical events in your feed in the morning for each day. I hope you have a great day.